We have our own in-house team that has designed this rocket from a blank piece of paper. Uh, we've built our own rocket engines. We've built our own factory with the world's largest metal 3D printers, our own custom aluminum alloys. Uh, we've tested this rocket extensively on the ground at our test facility at NASA Stennis Space Center. And then now we're about to launch it from a launch site at Cape Canaveral, Florida. Uh, this is the world's first 3D printed rocket. Um, it is by far the most amount of 3D printing content of any other product ever made uh, that, that we're aware of. So it's the largest 3D printed object in the world um, out of metal. So lots of firsts on 3D printing and demonstrating the viability of that technology. The other piece that's new is this is the first, uh, potentially first rocket to use liquid oxygen and liquid methane propellants, which are the propellants of the future for what will be reusable rockets. The first payload um, is a 3D printed section of our very first trial 3D printed part. Uh, so when we founded the company seven years ago, we actually kept a case with the part that we tried to 3D print for the first time. No one had ever done it. So of course that 3D print failed and it's kind of an ugly mess. Um, but we are launching that actual part from seven years ago as a representation of all of the thousands of challenges we've had to overcome inventing this 3D printing tech to finally now have a rocket on the launch pad ready to go. 